So one thing that I always hear is quality holsters are too expensive. So I'm gonna go buy something shit, like a $20 Blackhawk Serpa or something like that, because you don't wanna spend $250 on a brand new Safari Land from Safari Land for your gun, okay? These are some of the nicest holsters out there. Now, I do understand you not wanna spend that much money on a holster. I don't wanna spend that much money on a holster, but there's options out there. And I'm going to show you one today, and I'm going to start a new series to show people that you don't have to spend $250 on a brand new Safari Land to get good quality. So we're going to open this up. This is a Benchmade Sock P. I can pry it, but I'll bump the tripod if I pry it in frame. Okay. So. I got this on eBay for $25 shipped. Look familiar? It's a Safari Land. It's just in a different shade of green, and it's not a level three, and it doesn't have a light, but it's a Safari Land. And you see this fork? I had to add this to the Safari Land for $20 extra, so 250 plus 20. This one just came with one, okay? See? see that the hood does work and does stay in place as it's supposed to see this is this holsters for a Glock this one's for an M9 so we're gonna see if it fits now something that I always recommend is when trying out a new holster do not put a loaded gun into the holster because sometimes there's material on the inside that can get um, like bent during shipping or just be made badly or something like that paperwork I took out could be in there and you not see it and it can pull the trigger so be careful this is an unloaded gun by the way so let's see it goes in will the hood close it will and will it drop it will so I just got a level two Safari Land holster with the QoS fork already installed for $25 shipped. Good gears out there. It's not hard to find. Look for it.